Vice President Lai Qingde on Tuesday set off for Palau, one of Taiwan's last remaining diplomatic allies. Lai will be in the island nation for three days to boost bilateral ties, tourism and cooperation. The state visit comes weeks after a visit of Palau's president to Taiwan in October, during which he invited Taiwan's presidency to his country. Let's hear what Lai said before departing from Taiwan. Taiwan has opened its borders and it is ready to reconnect, not just with the Republic of Palau, but also with the rest of international society. Taiwan and Palau are both ocean countries. With this visit, I hope that we can boost the economy and tourism in the post-pandemic era. I look forward to increasing cooperation between the two countries on the front of diplomacy, tourism, medical care, education, culture, or any other aspect. I hope we can develop a step further on all fronts and work toward further deepening our work on democracy, freedom, and human rights. Lai touched down in Palau at 1 p.m. Taiwan time, after which he sat down with Palau's president. He then attended a reception at the Palau National Congress. After that, he took part in the groundbreaking ceremony for a new road project, spoke with the technicians working on the project, and attended a state banquet. On Wednesday, he is scheduled to visit the Rock Islands with Palau's president. His itinerary for the third and final day includes a plaque unveiling ceremony for a Taiwanese telemedicine center and the donation of equipment for the Palau Major League.